So, what do you get when you cram a bunch of creative geniuses into one world? Well, you guys are about to find out because we got a bunch of people here and they have a lot of cool stuff they contributed. So, let's see who's here. Say hi to YouTube guys. Let's see. We got Astrak, Johnny spamming it up. Some Meister. Johnny still spamming it up. And there goes someone in the bus. We had Umweld here earlier, um, and that's Johnny, hogging up all the hying to YouTube. Subscribe, subscribe, that's Alstrak doing a plug for me and our community. Johnny, stop spamming. No. Every community's got one. You just learn to roll with it. So, um, yep, stay tuned guys because this is about to get for real, yo! Okay. This is a Scrap Mechanic Labs update. It seems that we had a group of friends get together and decided that I guess the place where I was working in and doing all my labification and experiments was a little bit shabby. Yeah, I know I like to hang out outside in the grassy grassy fields, but you know, sometimes lab professionals should have a lab facility. So this was a community build, a bunch of people got together led notoriously by Sheriff Monkey um, a lot of other people did some builds here this is like the main entrance there's there's a little secret there's a little secret button behind this duck logo let me click it if I could get it in the middle of my screen got it oh 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 and there you have it the official community built Scrap Mechanic Labs Headquarters. When I first was shown this, I could not believe I was so amazed. I was like, this is incredible. And then more people started showing up. We had someone built, I think I know who they built this, Umweld, built this giant logo statue. Another friend of mine built the ducky statue up on the hill. So when you're looking out over the Scrap Mechanic Labs Kingdom, you could have a duck statue. Maybe even little duck pigeons flying and landing on it. More duckies. We all know I'm a big fan of duckies. Now, um, we just recently had an update. So this is also going to serve sort of as a um, support video to show you... Oh, um, weld has just joined which is fantastic um this is the same map where we did our camping adventure if we could look from up here down there's the campsite with all those vehicles parked out front I had a bunch of friends come go camping with us we had a camping good time down there we'll be able to get there as we do further continue this tour but I know you're all dying to get inside of the, the headquarters here that was built. This was the bus. The fun bus. Now, there's some vehicles that aren't parked here that are normally parked here. But, um, things started to get a little, a little on the laggy, the laggy side. So, so they had to get moved a little further away. But here we have a glass encased Scrap Mechanics Labs logo. A nice little waiting area for people to wait and you know if they gotta go 
There's a nice little restroom here for them to use the restroom. And um, you can see it's it's got those typical restroom doors where people can like peek around and look at you and make you feel kind of weird. But they always have those gaps in the doors. I don't know why all bathrooms are made that way. It's like suggestive privacy, but someone could still like try to look in through the crack there and you'd be like, dude, you're freaking me out. Stop doing that. Stop trying to look through. And you like hang. Have you ever done that where you hang like a piece of toilet paper over the crack? Because you kind of like, you know, weirded out by people trying to peek in through there. But anyway, still, I mean, that's the way restrooms are. And we made a reasonable facsimile here in the waiting room for the Scrap Mechanics Laboratory. There's some other cool stuff. This actually is deployed. This is, has a mode where you can tuck it away. <coughs> oh, excuse me. My goodness. I still have that cough, guys. It just does not go away. Oh, we got someone else who's joining while the video's going on, so... That's the way it's gonna be. We're gonna have lots of friends during the video doing the cameos. But, um, I can't let the video go too super long. Not super long. Okay, this this was behind the staircase. And here's where we have our secret control room with auto-closing doors. I need to be a little faster here. Woo! Inside. Inside. We got, like, a little workbench here. I guess is where we put the computers. Computer room. And here, click, is our master control room this has like the doorbell you know what we got a doorbell and I was just reminded we have a doorbell because I found the doorbell mechanism and so now that you've had a peek into the uh, brains control center of the scrap mechanic lab let's go over let me close this if I can aim on it I try not to use the HUD because it looks nicer in the video but man it means you have to have like sniper skills to hit these buttons so alright let me see hopefully my volume is up there's a doorbell you guys hear that? yes Doo -doo 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 -doo. it's got a doorbell and everything I thought that was so cool um okay um well I'm well I'm well's here and it's also a great bridge to the next thing Okay, we gotta go upstairs. We gotta go upstairs, because this is only half. Just wow, guys. You guys are so amazing. The stuff you guys build, contribute on other people's servers, and it's hard to build on other people's servers, too, because it's laggy. It can be pretty laggy. The more complicated, the more stuff we add, the more difficult it becomes to build. So that just means the more inspired you guys must have been which is totally awesome up here on the second floor it's still assembling itself we have a beautiful observation deck which allows us to look off into the distance <coughs> clear my throat once again because I'm a big time coffer I'm one of those sick youtubers that are always there all right this was the landing pad that uh, uh, Johnny, Johnny built, Johnny builds scouts, super scouts, not just regular scouts. Whoa! I was so excited I just jumped out. There was still stuff up there I wanted to look at. I need to be, I need to move faster because there's so much cool stuff to go over and I, I kind of get, I kind of lose track of what I'm talking about. But, uh, oh yeah, big projects. If you work on really big projects, Try to get those projects done between updates, game updates, because sometimes if you're working on a really, really big project, you do a game update and it breaks it. It breaks your world. So try to work that out between updates, guys. This is a tale of caution from Chief Engineer. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump on this thing. and. Uh, we're gonna go find some other cool stuff that's distributed throughout the realm here because people just build stuff and they um, drive it away. And we gotta go hunting, so let's take a look around. Jumping on this little meteor. And uh, 
Okay, there is one of them. That's another one of Umwell's designs. Let's fly right up to it. Ooh, that hurt. Um, oh boy. This thing is so cool. But I had to put it up on jacks. Because these flat surfaces, when you lay them down on other flat surfaces, it's a killer for frame rates. But... I'm actually going to put the HUD back up now. Hopefully it's not bugged. Yay! It's not bugged! Alright. And, um... Umweld built this transforming boxcar. Which I really like, because if you're... Like, if you fall off a mountain or something while you're driving it, you could just box up and roll around in your box. Oh, we got somebody else here. I'll say hi. Hi, amigo! All caps. So he knows I'm screaming, hi amigo, very loud. Let me unbox the boxcar. It's me! Let me uncaps here. Say hi to YouTube. Say hi to YouTube, friend. Um... <laughs> <laughs> what have I did? I put them on to reduce lag. <coughs> oh my goodness. He did not like that modification I did. But let me turn on the music. No, that's a transformer. I'll have to explain that to him in another video. Well, when he watches this video, he'll understand because I said that uh, the flat part's already, so... He doesn't understand now, but when he watches the video, he'll know. We're like having a little car crash race here. Boom, chicka boom, chicka boom, chicka boom. Very cool, very fun. <laughs> How does that make sense? Trust me, it makes sense. I wouldn't steer you wrong, I'm weld. You're a good guy. Hey, okay, I'm going to put this, this fun, fun build away. I'm going to put it on the sticks here to, to kind of help with the lag there. And I'll drop it right there. Boop. And it'll kind of stay there. And because you don't have that hard contact area against the ground, less lag. Now I'm going to jump back on this thing. Wiggle it around. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. And let's head for some other stuff. Let's look around. If I remember correctly... The other stuff was around the edge of the world. Oh, we got like a race going down there with two cars. Two people are racing around. Let's see if we can get a better look at that. I know I get distracted so easy. Showing you just how tricky it could be to fly one of these. I never said flying a meteor was easy. But I did say it was fun. Um. Who was that down there? Oh, I don't know. I think that might have been Umwelt. Because he saw the mods that I did to his little car. So we're going to go this way. And ouch. Whoa. Whew. Stuck for a second. But as you all know, seats are impossible to get anything stuck into. So if your build is small enough and it's made primarily out of a seat, you're not going to get stuck too often. Now, off in the distance over there, I think I see where I want to go. Yes, those are Johnny's builds. Someone sort of got on it, and because the server was a little laggy, they accidentally kind of glitched it away. But I was able to recover it. So you can see one of the vehicles I got over there. Woo! Slid to a stop. He's, he's safe. He's safe on home base get right over here next to it another build I want to show you guys that was made here at the lab a super scout created by Johnny Harbison the man himself Ooh, ooh. that's a prototype can't show you that yet experimenting over there don't look, don't look at it don't look at it it still might not be good enough to reach the epic fun levels I want the builds to have Wow, I landed right on the seat that had all the controls. Alright, check this out. Johnny made this so that when it takes off, 
landing gear automatically retracts. It's got the same control scheme as a Fat Scout or a regular Scout and you can take a bunch of friends on it with you. That's why I like these. I like them that you can take all your friends and you can even drive it around on the ground. Johnny, you did a fantastic job. Oh, someone found the other prototype that I had lost. <laughs> so, I hope you guys like the update to... Actually, there never really was a previous lab video. So this is like the first. It's not an update. This is like the lab video with the community build. And uh, I think that's Al Strack on here riding along on the Fat Scout with us, showing you all its features, its drivability. Um, I showed you that. I showed you the stuff. Well, yeah, it's really cool. I want to give a special thanks out to everyone who contributed and helped out. Please leave a comment if you did something and I didn't mention you because I want everybody to be recognized for how they contributed. Um, thanks to you guys. You're making this channel amazing because it's getting full of amazing people and amazing subscribers. And uh, I'm so glad I could be a part of this. So um, remember guys, keep building, keep imagining, and remember the best things we could get out of all of this is not the cool stuff we make, but the friendships we make along the way. So, I need to end this video because my hard drive gets full so fast. But, stay cool guys. Dream it, build it, and build those friendships. So awesome. I gotta fly. I got too much stuff I need to do. I got too many people I need to hang out with and have fun. Take care. And woo! Adios. Ouch. Ouchie. Woo wee. Back to the lab. Back. Back. To the laboratory. Dun 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 dun. Ouch. Ooh, look at that. I was so not expecting to land on this landing pad. And we got some more people here building. Okay, is this the end of the video? Did I end the video yet? No. Because I get so easily distracted and I find other stuff to do and then I start having fun and then the video goes on. So this is like outtakes. Yeah, okay. Yeah, we're doing outtakes now. I think that's Unweld working on the statue, touching it up some more. There was someone out there. Out, I left somewhere off in the distance with that uh, fat scout. Hope they have fun riding it around. A new vehicle, someone just built it! So cool! So many cool things! Another car! What are you guys? You guys are breaking in these new seats and it is so cool! I can't wait till I do some cool stuff with the new seats! You guys got a sneak peek at some of the prototypes I'm working on. Proto ta 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 prototypes! If I can get that word out. Um. We had a little bit of an issue with the bus here. It got to, it got to kind of bigger suspension. Okay, we gotta let that guy in. Okay, sorry guys. Okay, I'm actually gonna end the video now. Yes, after I let this guy in, I'm gonna end the video. Let me end the, let me see there's a button, got it. All right, come on in bro. No one is excluded. I have the bus. Let me in. You can come in, Pips Week. All right, guys. It was fun. Oh, wait a minute. There was one else, one else other thing. Oh my gosh, my language is so bad. If you um, there was a, a room that I found up here in the lab, and I was like, what is this room? What's going on with this room? <coughs> <coughs> this is like the super S room for I guess the super guy. And I remembered when I was talking to Monkey, he was asking me questions about what I wanted in the lab. He's like, where do you want a throne? I'm like, a throne? I don't need a throne. And there's like a throne here. And I'm like, I'm a chief. Chiefs don't sit on thrones. That's what kings do. A chief is like, you know, kind of like an Indian, you know, Indian chief, kind of, sort of. But then I saw this thing here. I was like, what is this? All right, let me try it out. I sit in the seat. 
And I got my, my big screen TV here, cool. We gotta watch my movies and stuff, you know. Netflix, Netflix it up. And when I hit the button, look, my drink. It's like my drink drinker. I don't even have to reach out to like pick up the drink. It puts it in my mouth. I was like, wow, man, that's like fancy. I'm so fancy. You already know something about going to Tokyo. All right, enough outtakes. Peace, peace to all you builders, all you fun guys. <laughs> uh oh, someone's jacking my ride. Someone's GTA in my ride. Bye bye guys, and take care, and thanks for sharing. Wait, I gotta look profoundly up into the sky. There we go.